Mais uma vez, bom dia. Uh, agradecemos mais uma vez a presença de todos os presentes aqui neste webinar sobre a Acrónia e Cybercloud. Uh, sou, Rica, sou Ricardo Monteiro, sou um dos responsáveis sobre a, sobre a Acrónia na Tech Data, juntamente com, com o meu colega Pedro Leitão. Uh, tem os nossos contactos uh, no ecrã. Caso tenham alguma dúvida após o webinar ou estejam interessados na, na solução, uh, podem contactar-nos. Uh, para apresentar este webinar, vamos ter a Anastasia da Acronis, uh, que é a técnica da Acronis, e vai dar aqui um, um overview sobre, sobre a solução. Uh, Anastasia, uh, when you want to start, uh, the show is yours. Uh, thank you very much for your presence and for your time. Ah, thank you. It's a pleasure to hear Portuguese. I hope that one day I can present also the presentation and the demo in Portuguese. Uh, I really hope uh, because I, I worked uh, with Portuguese but long time ago. Um, so, but today it will be in English. Just only one second. I will take water just in case I will not okay. be able to speak. Okay, <laughs> only one okay. second. No problem. Okay, here I am. I will share my screen now. Okay, thank you, Anastasia. Okay, uh, so we will start. We'll start with a presentation about Acronis Cyber Cloud. Uh, we will uh, check also about every solution that offers uh, Cyber Cloud inside. Uh, and uh, we will take a small focus on the uh, Chronic Cyber Protect Cloud with a recap of uh, the recent updates like from August, what we have, and also we'll check what will be available in the update of November because uh, not sure if you are aware, uh, we decided, or oh, better, uh, Sergei Vilausov, our CEO, decided that we need to um, release uh, uh, an update every month. So we will see also this. And we will have um, some time uh, after the presentation and demo, because we will jump also to the consult, Chronic uh, Cyber Cloud. We'll have some time to reply to your questions. You can write them all along the presentations and then we will reply on them. If we will not have enough time to reply to all of questions, uh, well, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, uh, Anastasia, uh, just one second, sorry. Uh, we are hearing you a bit. Uh, uh, will Pedro Cardo direct them to me and I will glad reply. Uh, you can expect to give to do it, I understand, but I will reply in English. Uh, Anastasia. Oh, so, let us uh, first recap about our company. Uh, the leader in cyber protection. Uh, yes. Uh, Anastasia, sorry. I think we lost her. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I think their connection. <laughs> okay, she's back. Yes, I'm sorry. Okay, I, I was telling you, uh, we were hearing you a bit bad. I think it's uh, because of your internet. I don't know. Maybe we just moved to a new apartment, but we already put a uh, Wi-Fi extension. So and no one is connected now because my husband left for uh, to his work 
he needs to configure some devices. So uh, I'm connect. I'm only one that connected okay. to to this. Okay, I internet. think it's better so now. Let's hope that it will not okay. drop me off once again. Okay. Thank okay. You. So let's recap fast about Acronis. Uh, so it's a Swiss Singapore 2003 with international headquarters based in Singapore now, corporate headquarters in Schaffhausen, uh, Switzerland since uh, 2008. In uh, 2020, uh, we are planning to grow to over 300 million in billings, growing over 50% with cloud business growing more than 100%. Among Acronis customers, every single one company of Fortune, mil, uh, Fortune 1000 list. Uh, since the company was founded, over 50,000 partners uh, transacted with Acronis. Uh, there are over uh, 500,000 corporate customers and over 5.5 million prosumers and home businesses. Uh, so Acronis is a global company with 1,500 employees in 30 locations worldwide. Products are available in more than 150 countries and are localized to our over 40 languages. Uh, so the rapid growth of the number uh, of the systems and devices is driving complexity. Uh, from less than 50 billion devices now, the number of devices will grow to over 500 billion devices by 2030, with only less than 1% of devices in a protected core data center environment. Devices outside of the data centers are harder to protect due to geographical distribution, lack of IT staff on site, variety of devices and systems running on them. The growing amount of data was just over 50 zettabytes in 2020, growing to over 500 zettabytes in 2030, drives an increase of the cost of storage, leading to the growing cost of protection. With growing costs, organizations are less likely to protect all data, applications, and systems due to economic reasons. Industrialization of cybercrime with criminals using uh, artificial intelligence to discover and exploit vulnerabilities, automation of attacks, and availability of services designed to execute and orchestrate attacks put in IT infrastructure under constant and security risks and increase the importance of protection. Applications uh, and uh, services uh, analyzing data and user behavior are removing privacy. Uh, protecting privacy while protecting data requires additional effort. The modern world is digital, so every person and business process is now conducted with data. Digital workloads have become mission critical and protecting the workloads is becoming more complicated. Protection becomes fifth basic human need, uh, as important as other human needs. And uh, Acronis presents a solution to the challenges of protecting the digital world, cyber protection. Uh, five vectors of cyber protection is safety, a reliable copy for recovery, uh, accessibility, ability to access the copy from anywhere at any time, privacy, complete control over visibility and access to the copy, authenticity, proof that copy, copy is exact data, uh, exact replica of the original, and security protection uh, cyber threats. Um, providing complete protection, Require, it requires a balancing force for all five vectors. The balanced approach allows us to get the benefits of cyber protection, ease of use, um, as all protection scenarios are integrated within one solution, low total cost of ownership as an integrated solution is less expensive in deployment and maintenance security as security is integrated into the overall protection solution control over the access and location of the data providing the ability to control the privacy of the data and reliability due to integration as well uh, as as all vectors are working together in one solution thus there are lower risks than from a combination of multiple solutions that may have compatibility issues, should be updated on a different schedule, may be controlled by different policies. So to deliver integrated cyber protection, Acronis constantly innovates, accelerating uh, feeling of patents over 
2050 uh, in 2020. One of the key innovation, um, sorry, uh, one of the uh, key innovations Acronis is working on is Acronis Cyber Engine. The agent is hybrid, working at the workload level, partner data center level, and Acronis Cloud. The engine is automatically learning and improves protection using uh, artificial intelligence and complex heuristics. The engine is autonomous, self-learning, and improving even uh, in the office environment, not depending on the cloud-based components to provide re reliable security. Autonomy allows the engine to protect against frequent automated attacks without the dependency on network availability. The innovation designed by Acronis enable product integration, providing a single solution, unified user interface, common management and policies across all products. Technology integration allows creating new capabilities to form a combination of technologies. For example, patches may be applied upon recovery, malware scans executed inside the backups, not loading the primary system. All Acronis products deliver cyber protection by artificial intelligence. There are key and provide this product. So I, it tracks protection and measures the assessment and uh, we are lost in you for a little bit, Anastasia. Uh, we hear you and then we stop hearing you. Oh, uh, okay. Let me try to connect to my hotspot. Maybe it will be better. Do you hear me now? Uh, yes, yes. Okay, perfect. So uh, let's continue. Um, so all Acronis products deliver Acronis cyber protection enhanced by intel uh, artificial intelligence. There are five key components provided by Acronis products, proactive protection, preventive measures are increasing protection level of data, applications and system by vulnerability assessment, patch and configura configuration management. Active protection, detection of attacks, protection of the applications themselves, reactive protection, recovery after data loss and attacks, migration, disaster recovery, and forensics capabilities for future analysis of attacks. Cyber notary, providing digital identity of data using blockchain technology. And cyber privacy, providing control to customers and partners over the location of the cyber protection management software and location of data, as well as encryption of data in transit and at rest. Uh, so um, traditional backups are reactive only. They do not protect of downtown uh, of, or data loss in, uh, in between of backup windows. Uh, they also cannot guarantee that the data recovered from the backups is original replica and was not modified in the past. ADC forecasts that by 2025, the global annual uh, size of created data will grow to one, uh, 163 zettabytes, uh, the, the 10 times the 16.1 zettabyte of data generated in, generated in 2016. The generation of huge quality of data is a key factor driving the growth uh, of global backup market. Its cloud segment is expected to grow from $1.2 billion uh, dollars in 2016 to reach $5.5 billion by 2023 with a CARG, 
CAGR of 24.2%, while a border data protection market size is expected to reach $1,025.8 billion by uh, 2023, rising it um, a market growth of 14.1% CAGR. Um, uh, the uh, ransomware protection market, an important segment of the data protection market, uh, that was worth uh, 9.88 80, uh, 98 sorry billion dollars in 2017 is protected to grow to 24.74 billion dollars by 2023 at a cagr of 16.34%. In addition to the data protection market, the cloud managed services market is becoming huge, almost 70 billion dollars by the 2000 23. Um, so, what are the uh, business needs of a managed service provider, cloud managed service provider? Improved security offering, maintain SLA, keep TCO low, troubleshoot quickly, monitor and manage with ease, uh, use reliable services. And we have also technology requirements, align and integrate services with the partners, automation centric business model, integrate new services with minimum investments, hardware licenses and trainings, maximum flexibility to deliver optimal cloud uh, model for the customer, private, hybrid or public, and protect as many customer data source as possible. Uh, so Acronis Cyber Cloud, is a platform that enables service providers to deliver cyber protection in an easy, efficient, and secure way. With one solution, you and your clients gain access uh, to backup disaster recovery add-on, now it's add-on, um, artificial intelligence-based malware and ransomware protection, security and management tools, file sync and share, and blockchain-based file authorization and e-signature services all managed from a single console. Uh, and also you can use the integrations. You can always uh, continue working with uh, RMM and PSA solutions that you're working every day uh, and continue working with them in Acronis Cyber Cloud. Uh, so, <clears throat> You can gain a great money <laughs> with these solutions. Uh, Cyber Protect Cloud Integrated Backup, Malware Protection Remote Desktop Management and Security Tools, Backup Cyber Backup Cloud, uh, number one hybrid cloud uh, build as a service for any uh, virtual, physical, and cloud environment, Cyber Disaster Recovery Cloud add on turnkey uh, disaster recovery as a service for virtual and physical workloads built on Acronis Cyber uh, Backup Cloud, but only in Acronis Cyber Protect Cloud Edition. Uh, Acronis Cyber Files Cloud, files in can share with uncom uncompromised uh, security and flexible storage. Uh, Cyber Notary Cloud, blockchain-based uh, file notarization, e-signing and authenticity verification, a brandable um, cyber infrastructure, scale out, cost efficient, and multi-purpose software defined storage solution. Um, <clears throat> so it's much easier to stand out when your solution goes beyond commoditized data protection solutions to meet modern challenges. With a complete cyber protection solution in place, um, service provider deliver more than simple backup uh, given uh, the giving them the upper hand to differentiate your offerings uh, and grow. Uh, so to start increasing revenues and reduce churn, simply educate customer about backup basics and the advantages uh, other related services offer. Uh, for example, disaster recovery and file sync and share. This process demonstrates expertise while increasing customer buy-in. Uh, since your business is already equipped to deliver these valuable services, you are set up for even greater customer appreciation and future referrals. Uh, so you can operate efficiently with a made for service provide solu solution. So it's starting to grow quickly with a turnkey solution as a service. Pay as you go pricing with per gigabyte and per workload licenses. 
uh, scale seamlessly with the multi-tier, multi-tenant cloud. So you can have as end clients and also partners. Enable RMM and PSA in custom systems integration, flexible deployment, so you can um, save backups in Acronis data center, uh, you can save them in data third party data centers, or you can name your data center. Or you can take your server and name, and name it as cloud. And also reinforce your unique brand with service wide labeling so your clients will know that the service is offering is offered by you and not by Acronis. Um, so uh, we have 18 plus five data centers that can handle all the backups of your end clients or partners. So you can choose uh, from 23 centers worldwide. Uh, obviously, I think you will choose the one closest to you. We are planning uh, to um, um, open data centers in each country where we have partners. So soon you will have also data center in Portugal. Um, now uh, our uh, business development team is making some agreements and deciding who will provide uh, for us the data center or it will be Acronis own one. But well, we are uh, working on delivering um, the security, even more security uh, for the backups of your end clients without exiting your country. Uh, so, Acronis data centers are reliable and follow the highest safety and security standard. Uh, so, uh, you can see that uh, we, our data centers meet international security standards, uh, such as ISO 27001 and NIST. And another slide will be about all the certifications that our cloud data center has. Uh, now uh, we will speak a little bit about the security. So how we access, how the people who are working in data centers are accessing this territory. So we have centralized access control, unique user IDs and strong passwords. So no one else can enter this territory. No one can steal the, the important data. Uh, secure authentication protocols, LDP, Kerberos SSH certificates, two-factor authentication, web application firewall. Uh, then we have data security, it's multi-layered and zone-based network, real-time data encryption in transit and at rest, secure data transfer over HTTPS, TLS, interface grade AS uh, 2056, encryption for customer data, and Acronis Cloud RAID technology data availability. Physical security, so high, high fences and 24 seven security control, biometric and hand geometry scan and proximity key card required for access. Uh, video surveillance with 90 day archiving, 24 per seven security personnel and infrastructure security. It's high availability and redundant infrastructure, UPS and backup diesel generators redundant HVAC network and UPS, um, uh, VSDA air sampling and dual zone traction, dry pipe, temperature and humidity monitoring. So these are the certificates that uh, possess uh, Cronis data center on world level. Um, so for most of us, customer acquisition is a primary focus because we think it's the primary driver of business growth. Uh, however, um, in the subscription business, it's not only about how many customers you are able to sign over a period of time, rather customer churn rate and um, cost per acquisition uh, play an even bigger role in your business growth speed and playback period timeline. The shorter, the better. In fact, upsell is what quickly growing companies use to hack churn rate 
and acquisition costs. According to McKinsey churn rate um, and the use of upsell are highly correlated. Low churn companies upsell to one third of their cl clients while companies with high churn rates don't upsell. Acquiring a new customer is also four times more expensive than upselling to an existing customer. It heavily impacts the payback time per customer, solution as a server businesses that upsell C, a return of investments after a single quarter or one year faster, a huge difference. Uh, Acronis CyberCloud offers easy cross-sell opportunities and bundles, so you can play with the solution as with a puzzle. You can create your own packages um, to make the add-ons to core products, for example, uh, the backup of the desk so desktop and also with anti-malware, um, the backup of Microsoft application um, and file notarization, uh, so uh, backup and disaster recovery, uh, Microsoft 365 and backup, G Suite and backup, so you can play with the solutions that offer Acronis Cyber Cloud to introduce your own packages and to gain your clients. Uh, these are solutions simple yet powerful, so it's easy to start, so few clicks to start your free trial, no investment required with Acronis hosted model, so you do not need to invest in your hardware to save the backups or to invest in some software to be uh, developed, ramp up period for new partners. Uh, easy to manage, web-based touch-friendly management console, multi-tier and multi-tenant architecture. So as I told, you can create end clients and also partners for quick services provisioning and minimum time spent managing customer accounts. Easy to integrate, one simple deployment for multiple services, integration with the most popular RMM and PSA systems, integration with custom provisioning systems via API, Easy to comply, in, uh, comply, you can store data locally in Google Cloud, in Azure, in Amazon, or in Acronis. Uh, store data in multiple locations, up to five in one uh, plan. Meet customers and regular uh, regulatory compliance requirements. Easy to sell and upsell, acknowledge and uh, in-demand services, reliable, easy, complete protection, increase RPU with easy cross-sell, and easy to build your own brand, comprehensive white labeling, leverage the power by Acronis sign, and flexible offering management. Uh, what are the key benefits for service providers? So delivers high uh, ROI and high margin best selling solution. So it protects uh, more than 20 platforms, servers, workstations, hypervisor, Microsoft on premises, and Microsoft 365 applications, Subhana, Oracle database, G Suite, iOS, and Android devices. It's offering Acronis Notary and Acronis A sign. Acronis Universal Restore technology restores your system to any available hardware in minutes. So uh, Acronis Cyber Protect award-winning protection leverage and uh, artificial intelligence based next generation anti-malware, antivirus and anti-ransomware, exploit prevention added with the previous update and uh, crypto mining protection to help you uh, safeguard clients. Adds value and reduces churn. So you can customize a lot of offering and bundles. Uh, you can make brand differentiation with comprehensive white labeling, protect more customer data sources, meet customer needs. So uh, fits your business model. You can choose uh, any deployment option from Acronis hosted, service provider hosted, or hybrid. You can create various offering, react faster, increase customer satisfaction, and have better slot than competitors with centralized monitoring, reporting, and alerting. So you can apply your own service model from self-service to premium managed service and integrate Acronis solutions easily with uh, your own business systems using management API. You can start fast with zero upfront cost. So you do not need 
any investment to start. Um, you can meet the dynamic needs of your customers with a 100% pay per use licensing model. Uh, benefit from a ramp up period for new partners. You can save money and increase your margins by reducing time spent in selling and configuring the solutions and eliminating the need to purchase and maintain additional hardware. You can deploy, integrate, and sell the services with ease, leverage marketing materials and best practices, sharing business and tactical trainings. Acronis is offering all of this. We have a partner portal with a lot of marketing materials you can find in our uh, official page a lot of best practices that are shared by great companies that use Acronis. And also we have a lot of sales and tra technical trainings. For example, now we are starting, yes, today we're starting the three days online course. Uh, I think it was Tech Associate. And a great friend for sales support from a designed team of marketing and sales specialists. So we are happy to help you with any doubt about marketing and about technical. I'm more with technical. <laughs> uh, and also satisfies your customers so you can protect all customer data sources, any device, any location, meet compliance and local law requirements with option to use Google, Amazon, Azure, Acronis or your local back backup storage. Manage storage tires and costs for your customers, serve a greater number of target markets and comply with local reg regulation by leveraging a range of so storage and deployment options. Uh, what are the key features for you, for service providers? So it was benefits, now they are features. Um, tenant management. So as you can see, we have here a graphic of hierarchy. So what can you do? Partner tenant, you can create a partner, you can partner can create a customer. So you can create partner, you can create customer. You can create folder. Partner that you created can create customer and a customer can create unit. <clears throat> so inside of the folder, you can create partners or you can create customers account. Then managing service and offerings. So we have uh, tabs with every solution where you can mark or dismark the offerings that you will provide to your partners and, and customers. Uh, backup operations and the dashboards, you can see all the information about the accounts, what is happening there, what is happening with the devices, what is happening with backups, what is happening on protection level. So everything you can see, you can delete, you can add, you can move, you can change place. You can also um, generate the reports in, in base of these <coughs> widgets. Customizable backup reports. Um, so as I told before, you can customize them. You can choose from these widgets what you can see. You can send them to you, to the admin, uh, from service provider side of the account. You can generate the report of all accounts or individually by every account, you can also send it to the customer. For example, customers sometimes also wants to see if everything is okay with their machines or with their backups. Um, comprehensive white labeling. So you can change the service name, you can change the logo, you can change the scheme, you can modify the links, you can modify also the um, uh, email address from where your uh, clients or end users or partners will receive notifications. If you have a domain, you can freely use it. Uh, so integration with service provider tools, as you can see, you can use this available integration. If you use something else, you can always choose RESTful API and configure the integration manually. Uh, then we have a table with the cloud integration for which services, which integrations are working. So you can see that with disaster recovery, so 
mostly they are working with all. In the Chronic Cyber Protect, you cannot use on app, cPanel, and Plesk. In disaster recovery, you are not able to use ConnectWise Automate, ConnectWise Counter, on app, cPanel, Plesk, and so on. But in most of the cases, you can use the most of the RMM and PSA. Uh, so let's pass to Acronius Cyber Protect Cloud. So this is a unique solution that integrates backup disaster recovery, uh, artificial intelligence based malware and ransomware protection, remote desktop and security tools, uh, backup and recovery of your application system uh, and the data of any device from any incident, anti-malware, next generation full stack, uh, um, artificial intelligence, machine learning based protection against cyber threats, including ransomware, uh, security and management, a comprehensive yet simple endpoint management toolkit saves the uh, IT resources. Eight innovative data protection scenarios, unique cap capabilities are enabled by integration and includes all features of uh, Acronis Cyber Backup Cloud. So this solution is complete, includes all required components to build resilient and secure infrastructure, integrated as one agent, no conflicts, perfect balance of data protection vectors, innovative, enables new data protection scenarios, saving money and improving uptime. Acronis Cyber Protect Cloud, what does it do? It uh, does prevention, so smart protection plans based on Acronis Street Alert, detects uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning based tree detection and behavior analysis, respond, um, gives the response to an attack with complete uh, artificial intelligence assisted visibility on the age, recovers, uh, makes attack remediation without data loss and with integrated patching, and also does the uh, forensic analysis, fast and precise investigation with forensic reach backups. Uh, so um, Acronis has more than 300 issued and filled patents with more than 50 new patents filled annually, including those uh, filed for all of the main features in Acronis Cyber Protect Cloud. Uh, so what uh, value uh, can offer these two service uh, providers? Uh, so uh, it's integrated security, so proactively avoid downtime to keep slash, less planned and unplanned maintenance time, quick and effortless recovery after an attack, real-time protection of the most important files, auto-adjust client protection for the most current treats, and ensure complete client data protection. Cost control, speed up and simplify onboarding of new clients and devices, serve more clients with less staff, centralized client patching with no additional costs, avoid expensive on multiple backends for multiple systems, less training expenses for your engineers and new revenues. Simply renewals by demonstrating your value to your clients, reduce data loss incidents, improve customer satisfaction, sell to clients with strict stricter compliance requirements, easy upsell to existing customer base and self-management security without hunting for expensive expert. Uh, so key features of um, Acronis Cyber Protect. So it ident identifies infrastructure and dis devices auto discovery, vulnerability assessment, uh, so infrastructure and devices auto discovery uh, once you um, uh, installed at least one agent on Windows based uh, device, uh, you can use the auto discovery function uh, to search other devices, even if they are not uh, the same operative system that you install the agent by IP, by Active Directory, um, loading the file with IP addresses. Um, so vulnerability assessment, it scans the device, Windows device, um, searching for some vulnerabilities. If, for example, some application is not updated or not installed correctly, data protection map. So uh, it's, uh, it, we added uh, there are 66 extensions that we consider uh, important and it makes during the individualization of data and it makes uh, a scan 
of the device on the specific time planned by you to identify if this device has these important applications with or applications files with these extensions uh, in order to protect them. You can add other extensions. Uh, then another option is an, another uh, feature is protect. So remote agent installation, backup and disaster recovery, uh, unified protection policies management, detect defense against malware and ransomware, hard drive health control, dashboards and reports, response, patch management was integrated, integrated with backup, malware quarantine, rescue with bootable media, and recover, backup under disaster recovery, forensic information in backups, and remote desktop. By remote desktop, we understand remote desktop uh, with RDP, with HTML and HTML5. Uh, you can um, share the connection with someone. For example, some of employer requires to have the remote desktop with this machine, but he doesn't have an account in the console. You can freely share the connection with him, providing a link that will work for 10 hours, and this employer can connect to this remote desktop. And another uh, thing the, about the remote desktop is the remote assistance, so you can connect to the device for the technical needs. Uh, so, innovative data protection scenarios, how you can use this solution. So, next generation continuous data protection, avoid the smallest data loss key and application, small smart protection plan, uh, auto adjust patching, scanning and backup to current CPOC alarms, better protection with less resources, safe and point recovery, fail safe patching, data protection map, forensic backup, and global and local whitelist. Uh, then Acronis Cyber Backup Cloud. So thousands of small, large service providers worldwide in, is succeeded by selling uh, an award-winning backup as a service solution uh, that's easy to use, efficient, and secure. Acronis Cyber Backup Cloud protects more than 20 platforms and incorporates the backup industry most advanced anti-ransomware technology on backup level, safeguarding data and systems in any environment, physical and virtualized, on-premise and on-cloud, is a turnkey solution as a service-based solution. It is and seamless to deploy uh, as it is to manage and does not add complexity to any IT infrastructure, having almost no impact on system performance. Uh, so key features of this solution, it's complete, so it protects all of these uh, solution applications, uh, Windows, uh, Linux, Mac, uh, the most of the hypervisors, uh, Amazon, Azure, Microsoft 365, G Suite, Microsoft Exchange, SQL, SharePoint, Active Directory, Subhana, Oracle Database, and the mobile device. So it's intuitive, scalable management, multi-tenant service, multi multiple points of custom branding, granular control over quotas, free customer trials, automated backup agent updates, fastest recall, recovery. We offer granular recovery, recovery even if we are making the full um, entire device backup, bare metal recovery from the scratch, full image and file recovery, Acronis Universal Restore, the ability to the possibility to restore the information from, for example, Windows to Linux, from Linux to Windows, from Linux to Mac, from Mac to Windows, so vice versa. Acronis Instant Restore, the possibility to mount instantly the virtual machine in, in the base of the native, native machine. Acronis VM Flashback, Remote Recovery, Any to Any Migration, Solve Service Recovery Web Console, Innovative Data Protection, Acronis Active Protection Notary and ASIGN, uh, TABX H format, encryption and password protection, and flexible storage options. So you can connect it with Acronis Cyber Infrastructure, you can use network storage, SMB, CIFs, DFS, and NFS shares. Uh, you can use Acronis Cyber Cloud Storage, Google Platform, Azure, external, external NFS shares, Amazon, IBM, Alibaba, um, uh, IAJ, S3. Well, this is object S3. Type uh, clever saves with uh, Swift object storage and a soft layer. Uh, so hybrid backup and recovery with Acronis. So you can see how the recovery works from where and how it's done. 
so you are doing image based or file level backups, incremental and differential uh, in air of the duplication and compression, physical data shipping and recovery is done by full image and file level, bare metal recovery run as VM with Acronist Instant Restore, dissimilar hardware recovery, any to any migration. Uh, you can stop ransomware weirds, um, artificial intelligence based ransomware protection. So, Acronis Sector Protection is a backup industry's most advanced anti ransomware technology. As I told, it's, this is on backup level. Do not mix it with uh, ransomware protection on device level. So, on device level, it's uh, cyber protect, on backup level, is cyber backup. Um, you can have complete Microsoft 365 protection, so backup for Microsoft Exchange Online. Um, OneDrive, SharePoint, and Microsoft Teams that we included recently this summer. Uh, so, okay, so. Uh, then also you can protect G Suite, uh, so cloud to cloud, it's ready to use. Options include Google, Microsoft and Acronis, protection for Gmail, Drive, including team drives, calendar and contact. So you can verify the authenticity of files in Drive backups with blockchain, search G Suite backups and flexible restore options. Uh, Acronis Cyber Disaster Recovery Cloud. So it's uh, an easy to use turnkey self service solution that is built on top of Acronis Cyber Backup Cloud. You can protect your customers' workload by instantly spinning up IT systems in the managed cloud recovery side and recover them to any similar or dissimilar hardware. Um, so you can use or you can see like the how this service is working. So on the customer side, virtual servers, physical service applications, you can connect via secure VPN uh, and restore the work of the machine via full image backup app replication. And then after you uh, restore the work of your native machine, it does a failback and uh, returns the updated information to your machine. Or you can go to restore it to another one if you are not able to recover the native machine. Uh, so you can see where disaster recovery is working in Windows and Linux, in virtualization platforms, application of our backup and recovery, and also for application with built-in replication like a SQL server always on. So you can improve RTO and automate disaster recovery with runbooks. You can use them to a little bit automize the service in order to not wait and click. You can just prepare this runbook and run it. Uh, Acronis Files Cloud. So um, this solution provides office and mobile user with safe file access, sync and share in an easy to use, complete and secure hosted cloud solution. Easy to sell and implement, Acronis Files Cloud expands your product portfolio and help you quickly attract new customers, realize incremental revenues and reduce customer churn. Uh, so what you can uh, offer with uh, to, to, to your end user users uh, with this solution. So collaboration using web desktop mobile, full text search capability, edit office files and mobile application helps to meet data governance regulation, maintains the history of all tra transactions, protects against data loss, stable on slow internet connections, safer than Box, Dropbox and others. Um, what advantages you can have using this offering this solution to your end client so you can expense product portfolio with no additional investments provisioning api for psa and vmm integration delivers strong reliability and availability and serviceability requirements full integration with acronis data service cloud and portal use any storage so acronis swift ceph nas s3 and azure tie your customers prevent revenue loss reduce customer churn so what are the cool uh, options here in CyberCloud? Uh, 
uh, for user, uh, sync and access from any device. You can use web, desktop, mobile devices. So for desktop, you can download a client. For mobile devices, you can download an application. Edit or comment office files directly in the mobile application. Share files with, with co-workers or external people. Full support for MC Office mobile app. Deployment, it can be hybrid or hosted by Acronis, multi-tenant uh, with multi-tire support for resellers, safety, browse and restore previous version of files, store files in known secure location with access from anywhere, restore deleted files in transit and on-device encryption, customization, branding, UI look and feel customization, multi-language support, platforms, full BIO, uh, BYOD support, desktop and laptop PC, Mac, mobile, iOS, Android, and web browser support. Integration, provisioning API for integration with third party of, or in-house control panel and panels, using usage of reporting for billing system, and Acronis storage repository. Um, and the last uh, service here is Acronis Cyber Notary Cloud. So is a blockchain based for of file notarization, e-signing and verification for organizations of any side, uh, size. It creates a digital fingerprint for files and stores in the public blockchain ledger, which enables dependent um, uh, independent validation of its authenticity and proof of the uh, the file existed at a specific date and time. So the advantages that you can offer uh, that you can have. Uh, so ensure the integrity of business critical data, achieve greater regulatory transparency, reduce risks to data security, accelerate and automate the signature process. Uh, so how your business can benefit from data notarization. So uh, first of all, this service can use any industry, industry including healthcare, law, manufacturing and finance. Uh, to verify the integrity of their business critical data while achieving regulatory transparency and decreasing security risks. Uh, so you can, they can verify that the file is unchanged or has changed. Uh, for example, contacts, media files, surveillance, camera footage, medical records, rental or lease agreements, loan agreements, uh, to confirm and create work originated on a certain date, for example, videos, photos, audio files, etc. Sub, uh, substantiate a legal document existed when you claim it did, for example, non-disclosure agreements, independent contractor agreements, confidentiality agreements, property registry records, etc. Then show that bills were paid when you said they were paid, for example, financial documents, insurance documents, etc. Prove a document was signed by certain parties and on a specific date, example, digital contracts, purchase orders, internal policies, petitions, or any other file, then you can increase speed and simplicity for remote workers with easy online signatures, insert your signature with an easy drag and drop and sign features into sales contracts, voices, and non-disclosure agreements. And it's designed exclusively for service providers. Acronis Cybernotely Cloud gives you a full proof way to sell more while earning clients trust. So these are the insights of Acronis Cyber Notary, Ethereum blockchain, advanced e-signature functionality, easy to use web interface, comprehensive white labeling, smooth integration with API, any type of data, trusted and independent verification. Acronis Cyber Infrastructure, this we will pass um, fast. So this is a solution that offers you the possibility to uh, add other storage, that is not a chronic, so third party or your own. So it's easy to use, cost efficient and secure. So it can be NFS, iSCSI, S3, uh, Cronis Backup, Gateway or VM. Uh, so the, the what you can use for, for storage delivery and service enablers. Um, and then uh, about the updates. So 
Uh, what we will introduce was the November update. Mostly it's written across Cyber Cloud, but it's uh, like mostly for Cyber Protect. So support for VMware and vSphere version 7, agentless backup and restore for Virtuoso Hybrid Server 7.5 virtual machines, and new UX for Cronis Cyber Protect monitor. What have we have done in the previous update in October one? Uh, so the simplified and automated disaster recovery setup. So you can set up a disaster recovery infrastructure uh, just automatically. So it takes the information from your infrastructure and creates a server automatically based on the device CPU, RAM, and network configuration. Uh, so we also introduced support for Mac OS Dixure. Uh, in September update, we had embeddable e-signature and protection for Citrix workplace. And in August, uh, we added Cyber Protect Essentials editions to protect workloads that doesn't need to be backed up with Cyber Protect capabilities, antivirus and anti-malware, URL filtering, vulnerability assessment, patch management and remote desktop, also exploit prevention, read-only role for disaster recovery, URL filtering, uh, widget control, so we added new widget. And well, July, Microsoft Teams protection, read on the administrator role, cyber fit score, enhanced password policy, enhanced URL filtering. Uh, so um, I forgot to add in my presentation, uh, sorry. <laughs> I forgot to add in my presentation the um, slide with the uh, differences of the uh, cyber protect um, uh, editions. My fault. Well, trying to trying to find it now so so we can check check it i still do not see any question do not be shy uh, Uh, I Anastasia, uh, if you want, you can move on to the demo. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think we are getting a little bit short on time. So. Okay. So um, this is the cyber, Acronis Cyber Cloud Console where you can create the accounts for your end clients or partners. All the solutions are divided by. Uh, different tabs so you can see here the consumption in cyber protect file sync and share if you use cyber infrastructure physical data shipping is a solution when your end client or well end client uh, doesn't have good uh, connection so the first backup that is full it's a little bit difficult to do so they can with this solution physical data shipping to make a backup on the external um usb for example and um, give this usb to you so you will load it to cloud or you can send them to us and the cronies will load it to cloud and also notary uh, so we have here overview again every solution divided by uh different tab you can see all the information about all accounts then uh, you, here you can generate the reports. And in settings, you can add your own storage or third party storage. In branding that I will show here, I have an example. You can like personalize it. And in API clients, if you prefer to configure not via web console, but via some coding, you can create here a uh, username and um, use uh, the application that is easy for them. And I do not know Postman, Microsoft Visual Studio. Then uh, more security for the administrators and this is the integration tab. So let's create a example of 
customer account. I will put the name by case. Then we can choose mode trial or production trial. There are 30 days and then automatically changes in production. You can choose here the language that your customer prefer. Then management mode. This is really important here because uh, by default it's self-service. So if you will skip this part and go forward and save this account, it will be managed by your client. And then if you would like also to manage it, you need to go to your client asking to create an account. Instead, if you will choose managed by service provider, you will create an account and then in the users tab on customer level, you can create an administrator also for your end customer. Then you create a name, a username, you put your email, first name and last main names are optional. Again, language, next. And here you choose the solution. Uh, so my account was created um, long time ago. So I can see also the previous editions. If your account will be your trial account will be created, let's say now in these days, you will be able to see only these two editions because you do not need any more this one. This we left for the service provider that we already have that we had before when these uh, editions were available. So they will be able to pass uh, to the edition that they prefer, Cyber Protect or Cyber Backup. Cyber Backup always by gigabyte and uh, um, only backup and vulnerability assessment, the active protection on backup level. Cyber Protect, not only backup, anti-ransomware, antivirus, uh, URL filtering, patch management, uh, disaster recovery are done and it's always by workload. So you choose what you prefer. For example, I will choose Cyber Protect because Cyber Backup has only one sub edition, Cyber Backup. That is also visible on Cyber Protect level because you can choose only backup. For example, if you prefer to be um, factorated by workload because for you it's more being beneficiated uh, beneficent um, and only to do a backup for your end client you can always choose cyber protect like this you will be factorated by workload but in cyber protect edition you need to disable the sub editions and leave only the sub edition cyber backup so i will choose this one because it has everything and we go here and then we can do a mix of sub editions or as I told, disable, disable cyber protect edition and leave only cyber backup one. And also remember that if you want to offer to your client cyber disaster recovery um, solution, you need to choose cyber protect edition. And obviously to have a cyber backup or any of these editions offer offer the backup, but these have also also the protect options. This has only backup option. Uh, you can, as I told before, you can make a mix. You can have even all of them. For example, some of the device in essential, some of the, in the standard, some in advanced. Um, and you can put the quota here. So, for example, I will take as an example cyber protect essentials workstation, but it works. Uh, the same way with other um, options here. For example, I will offer for my clients mm, the possibility to backup and to protect five workstations. Uh, so I can put here three and in overage I can put two. Since when he will reach the number of quota, he will, my customer will receive a notification that he left only two with two devices to register. When he will reach five devices in total, he will not be able to add new devices, but he has two options if he wants to add new devices. First option is to delete already registered and register the new one, 
or he needs to um, get in touch with you, with service providers to uh, change the water. Uh, regarding storage, here it's working a little bit different. So, for example, here I will offer 500 gigabytes, 450 in quota and 50 in overage. So, when client will reach the limit in total, 500, he will not be able even enter to the console. So, not like with the devices that he was be was able to delete. Here, no, you he need to to get in touch with you, with the service provider, to change this quota even for one gigabyte, for 500 megabytes, but in order to access and to delete something else, or you will pass him to another level. And then you can also put the quota for disaster recovery storage, because uh, it also requires, it copies the information to disaster recovery storage. For example, we had here, let's say in advanced, another two service servers, for example, and these two servers, customer wants to protect with disaster recovery service. So, and uh, from these uh, 500 gigabytes, we, for these servers, we have only 200 gigabytes. So, obviously, for disaster recovery storage, it will be less than the full backup storage. So, you can put less gigabyte here. Then, compute points depends on the potency of the device, CPU, RAM, and the time when this, um, uh, the, um, virtual server exact copy of the native machine work it in case of disaster recovery if not will not you will not consume compute points then if you will need if customer will need public ip address you can also use them you can put the limit and also the limit of the cloud servers that customer can create and then we can put also the quota for local storage that we intend local folders and nas folders also in other solutions have tabs. So on the second tab, if you choose this solution and select services, you can configure the amount of users that can use file sync and share, and also the amount of storage that they can use for this service. Physical data shipping, how much backup can be sent to cloud with this solution, and notary, how much notarization they can do, can do uh, how much documents they sa can sign and how much storage they can consume. So this is the account uh, we created and this is, um, I'm still waiting for your questions. Please do not be shy. Meanwhile, meanwhile I will try to find this uh, table. <laughs> with the differences of the editions that um, I'm sure that uh, the guys from uh, Tech Data will share with you if you will ask for it. Uh, if you prefer to have some kind of individual demo, um, well, you are free to do it. We can do this demo. Please contact your reference in Tech Data and they will contact me or they will contact my colleague. I'm working with um another guy francisco that is really nice he is really knowledgeable about acronis products and we will be happy to work with you uh, se alguém tiver alguma questão pode colocar no chat ou pode perguntar em, em português que depois também perguntar anastasia uh... yes you can ask yes you can ask in portuguese even <laughs> <laughs> it's not a problem uh, uh, Anastasia, do you have something else, or if no nobody has any questions, can we uh, can we can we end the the webinar? Uh, yes, I was. Uh, if no one has any questions, we can end it. I was just trying to, if someone would have and this writing now, I wanted still to find this uh, table, but um, I'm sure that uh, if someone will ask you, will share it with yes. them. Okay, so if no one has questions, thank you for your attention and well, uh, hoping that we will work together.